I just have something to show you. Um, last night I was playing around with some burlap flowers um, for a swap that I'm hosting at Life on the Scrap Beach. And um, I decided to make a couple more extras to show you, um, you know, how I make them. And um, I made some little samples to show you. And um, let me see, I'm going to show you this one first. These are just so much fun, you guys. You can use seriously any flower die cut that you have and burlap. And for all of these flowers, I use the Lindy Stampkin products. So um, I love it. I love how they turn out. So there is this one. There is also this other one. And it just has some pink and some blue. Super cute. This is one of my favorite ones because it's one of my favorite colors. It's like a very nice light pink with some red tones. And this one. Now for this one, um, on the edges, I just used some acrylic paint. So it's not Lindy Stampkin, but I love the turquoise color and the little center. Super, super cute. And here's this one in green. So I use a lot of Mika powders, um, Magicals, um, Stains, there's another one. So I just made these samples just to pretty much show you my little burlap flowers. Um, and then I decided to make this big one, which is super cute. I just love the center by Prima, very, very cute. And um, these are perfect for, you know, mini albums, tags, um, anything. So, um, I am really having a lot of fun making these flowers because they look so cute on projects and they're super easy to make. I also wanted to make my own um, canvas leaves and um, I had a canva material already for a long time. So, um, I don't have a die cut for leaves so I just did it by by eye just eyeball it <laughs> and um, this is what I came up with so here's one leaf and it looks really really cute for like the big flower so something like that super cute and I use the Lindy Stampkin stains on all of the leaves so there is that one there is this other pretty green color absolutely love it you see that very cute um, and I also made a couple of small ones in brown also looks really cute with the little flowers so I just I just love it I love it because then I don't have to buy so many leaves and so many flowers um, we all know they're not cheap so um, I think this is a great way to create your own and um, save some money if you don't want to spend too much money on them. So these are some other ones. So definitely you guys give it a try if you haven't yet. Um, I know a lot of people have been making these flowers and their own leaves and things like that. And this is what I came up with last night. So um, I hope you like it. Please let me know if you have any questions. And thank you so much for watching. Bye-bye.